to this week's vlog. Um, I've got a few things on this week. Um, so I'll start off with the one that you been following for a while I guess so a little progress on the shoe bill head um, so the sculpting's pretty much done so I need to work on the the joint um, and that will be all be over on my patreon um, but yeah so I've got a little bit of movement uh, I just need to do I haven't attached it just yet um, so I need to do a little bit of drilling and working on just the the actual joint for it um, so that will be the making, uh, but yeah, I think it's turning out pretty, pretty mean looking. Um, a lot of the bulk will be, uh, done with the faux fur as well. I probably need to hunt down some grey fur now that I speak of it, um, and see, see what I can come up with. Um, makes a nice sound. <laughs> um, what else? Uh, I had some leftover uh, epoxy sculpt, so I did a little horn. So I'll put that on a some kind of critter soon. Uh, also, you've already seen that the little black unicorn. So I can start cutting out some of the um, the patterns, the body patterns, so I can sew it up um, and have that on the go as well. So the commission that I am working on at the moment is a Irish Wolfhound. So uh, they're one of my favorite dogs. I just like the, 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 the size of them and everything. So I did a bit of sculpting yesterday. Um, so this is what we have. I've made the head a little bit thinner than, uh, which I normally do anyway. I make the head a little bit smaller because I'm going to be adding some um, faux fur to it. So it always makes it bigger. So. I tend to generally make the head smaller um, and then bulk it out using um, the faux fur so that's always a good tip when you're if you're just starting out and you're not sure um, yep yeah, obviously adding adding things to anything will make it bigger so I tend to sculpt things just a tiny bit smaller um, so it's not the head's not too big and out of proportion so um, for this one, I only added some texture around the eyes uh, and a little bit just around here. Um, the rest isn't very refined just because I'm going to be covering it with faux fur anyway, so there's no point spending all of that time refining some things um, and making it all nice and smooth. Um, so I generally tend to not do that, but yeah, I think it's looking really cute. Um, so I'll start with the painting and stuff as well. Um, I've got the faux fur, it just came in the mail, so I can start working on that as well. So kind of progressing a lot faster than what I thought it would. Um, but yeah, it's looking pretty cute. Um, and you can see like more images and stuff over on my Patreon if you're interested in that. The next one, um, I'm just sort of in the talks with it, uh, is a chihuahua, which is really funny given it's, I'm doing such a large dog and then now a chihuahua. Uh, so yeah, I'm just in the talks of doing that and finalizing a few things before that happens or if that happens, but that would be pretty funny. It'd be good to, um, yeah, do two different sized, vastly different sized dogs. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much what the agenda is for, uh, the rest of this week. Um, yeah. That's all I can really update. I'm ploughing through my box of sculpt, Sculpey. Um, I've still got a big, big chunk uh, of Sculpey that I ordered a couple of months ago anyway. So I've got all the stock I need for now. Um, but yeah, so that's a bit it. That's a bit it. Oh yeah, also. Also, also, also. I've been working on the Luna Moth as well, so I ran out of wire that I'm using for this, so I've ordered it and it's coming in the mail in the next couple of days, so I can continue I can continue on with the Luna Moth, uh, so I don't have the rest of the wire for this. Um, and then I'll add the rest of the patterns once the wings are all together and um, the doll is a bit more complete, but for now, uh, concentrate on the commission. Um, but yeah, um, I think it's turning out really well. I, I quite like the way it's looking. I don't know if you can see. 
Um, but yes, this the pattern for the Lunar Moth will be over on my Patreon for this month. Um, and it will come out around the 20th. So usually at the end of the month I do a little um, release of a printable. So that will be the printable for this month is the patterns for the moth. Um, and then I'll have the entire process uh, either on my Patreon or you can, if you're not on my Patreon or don't want to join, you could, you'll be able to get it in my store um, when I finish, um, when I finish doing it. <laughs> so um, and then I guess depending on how that goes, I might do some more patterns for uh, dragon wings or fairy wings or stuff like that too. So uh, just finding the time to do it. So so yeah, that is the update for this morning. Um, so yeah, it's looking pretty cool. I'm pretty happy with the way it's turning out. Um, but anyway, moth. Um, yeah, so I'll continue doing what I'm doing. Friday. Um, got a little bit done yesterday, so I painted the parts that need to be painted on the Irish Wolfhound, so um, I can start putting that doll together. I've got a whole bunch of faux fur that I need to cut out, so yesterday I drew all the patterns on the back of it, so I need to cut all those out today. Um, I have a few commissions to make a start on now, uh, like I said before, the Chihuahua, so um, I may start with sculpting that today, just depends, um, just depends where I'm at with the wolfhound, uh, but I got the core of the head ready to go, so I can make a start on that, have my sculpey, um, and then uh, another commission for a bear, like a Native American in inspired bear. Um, which is in the talks. So a couple of uh, a couple of things to do. Um, but uh, yeah, so I'll probably be cutting out a whole lot of faux fur today. So it's nothing extremely exciting. Um, but yeah, so I guess I'll just get started with that. today um 
what did I do? I pretty much just worked on the bodies um, for a couple of dolls. So the Irish Wolfhound body is sewn up. Um, I just have to start putting it all together. Um, and I sewed up the body for the unicorn, the black unicorn. Um, so still needs to be trimmed and sorted out. Uh, so sort of what it will look like. Um, so what do we got? Yeah, I'm really liking the color against the black. I think it's quite nice. Um, and the mane will become more apparent once I've trimmed everything. Uh, oh. uh, what else? Um, don't know if I showed you that, can't remember. So I painted up the face for the wolfhound. Um, yeah, a lot of the bulk, like I said, it's going to be done with um, fur. Uh, I haven't done anything on my um, shoe bill. It's still going, sitting, sitting, doing nothing. Um, I got a chihuahua commission to work on next, so I just prepared some eyes and stuff so I can start sculpting. Um, some eyes and a bear commission will probably come up next month but we'll see what happens with that um but yeah other than that that's pretty much it for this week um yes so that's it <laughs> uh so end the vlog here and uh i will start it again this week sometime um but in the meantime, you can check me out on Patreon. I have a whole bunch of things on there uh, that you can check out and my shop, creaturesofnat.com. You can also check me out on my social media at Creatures of Nat on Instagram and Facebook. And yeah, catch you in the next one. Bye. <laughs>